to show you guys one of the major limitations of valves. Effectively, how I use valves is only either to completely block flow by setting them to zero or to leave them completely open because they can't accurately represent different flow rates other than that. If you try and set a flow rate on a valve, it's not going to be what you can expect. And we can demonstrate this. Before we do this, I want to highlight something here. We go into our calculator and type in 600, which is what our range of expected values on the valve is, and divide that by 1.28, we get approximately 4.7. And this seems to be the value that valves can adjust to. So we can have zero, we can have 4.7, we can have 9.4, we can have 14.1 and so on, but nothing except those values. Those are the discrete values that a pipeline valve can be allowed to flow through. And so what we can do, for example, if we set this to zero, we get zero. If we set it to one, we do not see a flow rate of one appear. If we set it to two, we do not see a flow rate of two appear. And what it's doing is it's rounding to those discrete values. So one and two round to zero rather than rounding up to 4.7, but three, will round to 4.7. So if we set our valve limit to three, what we'll actually see is 4.7 goes through. And again, we can do this with any number. And what we're gonna see is we're always getting a multiple of this 4.6875 in terms of our flow rate. So seven, for example, is still closer to 4.7 than it is to 9.4. So we have our flow rate value set to seven, but we're only seeing 4.7 units flow through the valve. If we set it to eight, this should round up to 9.4 instead. And so the effect of this is that valves as a flow limiting tool have some really weird behaviors that make them very unreliable. You need to sort of know this math if you want to try and find a flow rate that they can do correctly, but setting them to something like 120, you're not going to see a flow rate of 120. You're going to see the nearest adjustment to that value, which might be lower or higher than what you expect it to be. And the reason that matters is because this can create sloshing. If you want to know more, check out the video linked below.